Jeff Rivera with Huffington Post. We had the opportunity to go inside and talk to Marco Delicato from the hit show, Ugly Betty. Marco Delicato, what's going on with you? Oh, hi. Good, Good to see you. So what does it feel like to be in such a huge show? I mean, Ugly Betty is huge. It's, it's awesome. I mean, it's been, what, three years now, so we're getting pretty used to this. Um, right. It's so much fun. I mean, I have an awesome cast, and we're just enjoying every minute of it. You know, we weren't expected to be here, so. So did you have any idea that it was actually going to be the skewed of a show? Definitely not. I mean, we were kind of like the underdog that came up um, out of nowhere and became a success. So we, I, I at least wasn't expecting anything except, you know, to meet some nice people and move on. But it turned into something that, you know, I made lifelong friends and something that, you know, is really awesome for my career. So I'm wow. happy. So after all these years, you still have fun playing the same character? Yeah. I think that it gets better each year because I'm more in touch with my character. Like he's basically my alter ego at this point. It's it's kind of funny because we all connect so much with our characters that when we're on set, when we're in that environment, we are our characters. You know, it's it takes a while to kind of get out of that when you leave work. It's like okay, I'm not I'm not him anymore. I have to be myself now. So for those who haven't seen Ugly Betty, what's it about? Why should they watch it? It's about a girl named Betty who has a job at a, a fashion magazine called Mode Magazine. And obviously it's called Ugly Betty for a reason. She's kind of an outcast in, in her own way. She's really quirky, clumsy, um, dresses in crazy clothes. She's not really the fashion magazine stereotype. And um, I play her nephew, Justin, who is the complete opposite that you think should be working at Mode Magazine. He's fashion obsessed and loves to dress up and wear crazy clothes and be fashion forward. And it's it's basically just seeing life through Betty's eyes and um, watching her navigate through everyday challenges that she has to go through at work and at home. So can you tell me, I know you're not really allowed to do this, but can you tell me just a little bit about what's coming up in the next season? I know, at least for Justin, that there's going to be a lot of uh, things happening at school with him. Um, he starts high school this year, so basically everyone can pretty much imagine what high school's like and just about what it's really like to be a teenager. You know, they're not sugarcoating this in any way. They're, they're telling the story about how real kids go through real high school experiences. It's not, I guess, put into Hollywood perspective. And I think that that's really, I think that's a really awesome thing because I think a lot of kids see kids that go to high school on TV and they're like, that's definitely not real. But things that Justin's going to be going through are definitely um, real, very real. Well, it was great to meet you, Mark. Great to meet you. Thanks a lot for your time. Thanks so much. It.